Welcome in everyone to the Emerald Mastermind Versus, where we say Pikachu loudly in the background all the time. Pika. I said in the background. <laughs> and we're on episode something or other, and that's the important thing. 16? I don't know. I don't know. Hey. Can you help her? Hang on. There. There you go. Good job. <laughs> So I put the Pikachu bank on the ground so that Mercy can play with it down there. So that's what we're going to go with. Right. And hopefully it doesn't work. But what's important is we're spinning this great wheel with 15 new challenges that I found. And if you ever want to see a challenge of yours on this wheel, don't forget to always leave it in the comment section down below. And while you're down there, go ahead and leave a like for it. Um, I do my challenges first, right, in this? Yes, you do. Yeah, great. Okay. Uh, so HM Slay, we just found this one. Um... Uh, I can only use Pokemon that have HMs on them for now. Ouch. Yep, that'll be fun. Great. Okay. What's Pardon your me. nice new challenge we've got right here? Come on, good pad. Good child. Uh, I want to confirm the specificity of this one. I'm confused. Run back home and talk to your mother. Then sit there for five minutes and catch up with her because you're a good boy. Okay, I'm going to ask for a clarification. Do I have to run? Um, I would say you can also bike. And since we don't have fly, it doesn't really matter. So. Uh, and go. All right, let's go cry. I need to look at which... <laughs> Oh. Uh, I can use Ursa Ring. That's nice. Um... I can use no one. Oh, wait, I can use Drowsy. He has Rock Smash. If I had gotten that, I could use Anchor Arms. I might have trio. I'm sorry, who was that? Anchor Arms. Why am I in Mawville? What? Training? I don't know. Uh, okay, so I know that I was getting ready to. Oh. Boop. Oh, now we're back. No, I'm back. Your, your screen's here all the time. I think I saw that event oh. um, on an episode a little bit earlier, and it was like, I, I still realized it before like 15 minutes, <laughs> but it was like, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, I had like half an episode. Well, what I really should just do is I should just add a key for it on the stream deck, and I could just like hide and Bam. show the layer. I mean, that makes sense. Yeah, and then like mm, even you could just press it for me, and that'd be a lot easier. Yeah, that makes perfect sense to me. All right, I guess I'm kicking your butt. I guess I'm gonna head to Norman, honestly. You are a bit concerned with his levels. Uh, I am a bit concerned with his levels. This is an echo chamber, by the way, if you didn't know. I mean, good luck. You think an echo chamber would be kind of, like, weird? It is. Oh, you've been in one, great. I mean, I've been in some caves. They have some really good echo quality. I guess that's pretty much an echo chamber, isn't it? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> yeah. Hey, what up, Gardevoir? I think this is a breeder. Is yeah. that what they're called? Breeders? Yeah, they're breeders. called breeders. Okay. See, I got my Pokemon knowledge. Oh, shoot. That's another thing we do. Pokemon knowledge quizzes. Ooh, yeah. This could be interesting. Yeah. I just need someone else to read us the questions. Because... And... Yeah, because like, we need to not have prior knowledge of the questions. Okay, I only fought one trainer on that. And you collided four times? Wow, wow. I mean, you can't be judged right now, so haha. -ha. What? You only get judged on your speed with the mock bike. Oh, okay. So why does that matter? Just a statement of fact. Oh, okay, great. I mean, I know I'm terrible at driving this thing. All right, let me ride. Wait, I could have went through Verdant Turf. Good job. You know what I probably could have done? Hmm. I probably could have just faced the trick house. You could get three? Three. Three? Three. Three. Three rounds of it. Three. Because you've got the cut, you've got the trapdoor thing, and you have the rock smash. I don't remember the trapdoor one. Actually, this is slightly faster. Is there a trapdoor one uh, in between the cut and rock smash one? I think so. Huh. Or it's right after the one of Rock Smash one. Yeah. Huh. Because you don't see this revolving doors one until after Winona's gym. Because that's when you see the revolving doors. Is that... Couldn't you do that? Wait. 
what HM do you get that allows you to do that? Or is he does he not allow you to until after? He doesn't you? allow you until you've been seen. Okay. Hey, hey, look, it's the guy we were just talking about. Ha! <laughs> My guy's about to get wrecked here. If that thing was on par. Then I would still superpower it. Oh, uh, that's fair. Yeah. <laughs> if it survived and clicked counter. Oops. What's yeah. funny is, is I also have slack off. <laughs> I accidentally... Oh, now I'm remembering my dead tentacle. Oh, yeah. What was its name? Ina. That's it, for a VTuber. It's amazing. You can remember things' names, too. Because I actually had hope for it. I couldn't tell you a single dead mod's name. I can't tell you most of my team's names. I have a weird thing for some names, I guess, when they click. Okay, finally. I made it home. I legit think Luck Bear is going to become, like, a staple on the channel for me. <laughs> He's literally been in two back-to-back -back series and been pretty important in both of them. All right. Now I just sit here. For what? Five minutes. Oh, yeah. Talk to your mom. I did. She healed me up and is like, hey. You gotta talk to her. And I also got her number. Oh, good. <laughs> now you can talk to her anytime you want. Are you just going to continuously heal with her? What are you doing? <laughs> I, had to I had to talk. To like, mom, we're doing great. I mean, I, I traveled a far portion of the region, got to see some new stuff. Uh-huh, yeah. Got to fight some cultists. Right, right. Do, do you want to explain more about those cultists to her? Uh, yeah, I, the Mr. Stone, the president of the Devon Corporation, asked me to deliver something to another guy. Uh-huh, yeah. And these cultists came to steal it. So I had to fight them. So they didn't steal it. Mm -hmm. What were they trying to steal? What sort of machine part hmm, okay how is the machine part gonna help their cult goals they weren't very clear on that they didn't oh, seem okay. very bright great and then their leader showed up and he was like i'll let you go this time hmm. have you talked to your dad yet no oh yeah me either <laughs> i mean do you have the divorce papers ready I mean, they're getting finalized with the lawyer now, but... <clears throat> this is <feels> so <laughs> Ooh. Oh, what? Legendary Claws, right? Yep. Oh. <laughs> I mean, you could... Oh. oh. Oh, my boy. That's really good. Pretty sure he learns th Thunder naturally, doesn't he? He does. It's his last move. Oh, so he probably learns in, like, the 40s. 50s, probably. Or more. Because legends get weird movesets. Because you find them at, like, level 50. I completely forgot where I was going this whole time. Like, why am I going this way? What's going on? Am I going back home, too? No, I'm just driving this lamppost, apparently. <laughs> uh, I feel like I took the longest way possible to get here. No, you took actually a fairly short way. It feels Ruster, so long. Yeah, you actually took a fairly short way. It feels forever, though. Yeah, it's probably maybe the way these games run. Mm -hmm. I mean, isn't it Oras? Don't they, like, teleport you there if you ask? Yeah. Yeah. They teleport you from Lava Ridge all the way to... Is it Rustboro they teleport you to? Or is it Petalburg? I think you go right to Petalburg. Um, I'm a little worried, actually. Um, first of all, my challenge um, ends in probably, like, you know, uh, seven minutes or so. Because I'm not sure how long uh, I've been sitting here. Um, I think at 11 minutes on the clock is when you'll go again. All right, that works. But if I oh, go in now and I get a bad challenge while I'm in there... You're screwed. Yeah. I mean, you're already in a rough spot. Because I know... You can only use two mon. Yeah. I mean, well, I mean, like, Mary is my strongest mon, so, like, that doesn't worry me a ton. But... Unless something just happens to body him. Um, quick question. Shoot. Is there a way that I can tell the weight without going to the Pokedex? Their weights? Yeah. No. Okay. Because I know for a fact there's a challenge on there that where it's you can only use your lightest mon. That'd be your Gengar. I would also assume that. It's either him or I guess the Quilava, but I would assume that, the Gengar. The Blossom is actually fairly light. I said Quilava. I mean... But I don't have the... Oh, no, we do have National Dex. Yeah, we put that in because we knew we were going to need it. Um, I actually don't know where Gengar is in this. Uh, you're close. Uh, I thought I already passed him or something because I just passed... There uh... I was not in New York close. 89.3. Okay. Huh. He's a heavier boy than I thought. Let me check. Considering he's you know, spoopy. Lava. Aqua. Lava's my lightest. 
Well, check Bell Awesome. Make double check that. All right, it's the other way. Whoop. Twelve pounds. Yeah, it's tiny. This thing is twelve pounds. I mean, look how tall it is. It's short. Uh, it's a foot tall. <laughs> I mean, twelve pounds is. Not... Bruh. You could literally be like, look at my baby. Yeah, I, I, I can't I can't do that right now. I, I can't be stuck with just Bell Awesome. <laughs> Drowsy my pee lighter. No. He's a fat boy. He's a little elephant trunk guy. <sighs> oh, there's eleven. I really wish I didn't come all the way down here. Like if I really thought about that, I just would have done a trick house. Alright. Uh do do Wait, Professor Birch, what the hell are you doing here? What are you doing there? Is he always stand there? I don't think so. I don't know if I've ever seen him stand there outside of like the beginning of the game. Hmm. Huh. It's been so long and I've never really go back often, so it's like, oh. Huh. Bella Weedle. I also have no idea what to do right now, because like I You need I... XP. There's no trade. Check your, uh, Poke Nav. You can see who wants to rebattle. Oh, man. Uh, is it in my map? No, it's match call. Oh. Do I actually have to call them? No. They have a symbol. Oh. Literally no one does. Ouch. And there's only one option. I have no friends! <laughs> there are days I know that feeling. Uh... It's fine, at least you always have family. True. At least my family likes me. Yeah. Why did I do that? I could have gone Rust Road of Verdant Turf. Why did I come down here when I have nothing to do for the next, like, four minutes? I basically did the same challenge Wait. you did. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm just, like, riding a boat. I think Mr. Briny has a nice boat. I mean, we had to see him in the remakes, and it's, it's a pretty nice boat. Yeah, I mean... I'd like to know what it, what, his, what what ships he captained during his uh, sailing career. Don't we get to know about that? Like at some point, they talk about it. No, all we know is he captained, and he was, wasn't afraid of any storms. But he, we know he captains the ferry in the post game. What time does no, time level? What level does Drowsy have? Twenty five or thirty. Oh, I guess I'll check that while I have nothing else better to do. I mean, while I run. This sucks. I basically gave myself a harder challenge. What is my challenge? Oh, right. I can only use Earth's Rang and Drowsy because of HMs. Yeah. And I guess I could teach someone else another HM. Selfie. Please get away from there. I mean, I have to get all the way back to Lava Ridge, so. Ooh, nice I mean, basically we were in the same boat. Yes, we were, but I didn't have to do this. You had to go back. Fine, I'll fight. I fight these losers. Uh, he evolves at twenty six. What a arbitrary level. Yeah. I mean, Gen One did a lot of weird stuff like that. Hmm. Oh wait, I have Leaf Blade. I was like, oh no, it's a pseudo Wudo. It has Rock Throw on my Charizard. I'm scared. Oh, whack. I guess I'm just gonna train this Drowsy then for the next few minutes. I mean, I might make a re make, make a recommendation. Head towards the desert. Yeah, but then I would have to come right back here if I have a good or bad challenge. I mean, the thing of that is, it's your best option for XP. Right, but like, I don't necessarily need XP. If I get a good challenge, then I can just move forward in the game. I'm just scared of getting stuck in the gym with a bad challenge. That's my only worry right now. I mean, whereas I kind of need XP. Yes, you do. I mean, Charizard isn't my lowest level. The level I mean, level is Lantern. I would say I would think he's basically on par with the rest of your team right now. I need to look. Because, like, he's right about what most of my team is. That starter XP really does wonders. But did I slap the Lucky Egg on you? Probably. Probably, probably, probably. Yeah, you oh. did. That plus starter XP is just, like, Boku. moving him through. 26. So, yeah, he's about on par. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to shift around then. It looks like your lantern's the only one who's kind of low. He, actually, your level's like almost identical to mine because my drowsy is about is the same level as your uh, lantern. Yeah, which lantern will actually be getting a nice buff soon. 
once I get Surf. So actually, your levels aren't behind mine really at all. The only one who I have a little bit over you is He's my rank. Yeah, who's like almost 30 now. He's an absolute beast of a boy. Well, yeah, I can pretty much solo the rest of the game with an Ursarang with his moveset right now. Mm -hmm. Whereas once Charizard gets Flamethrower, it's going to start getting nasty. Plus, I have a Flyer on my team, whereas you don't. Do I not? Nope. Means I'm probably going to end up teaching someone Fly. Uh, we're going to bail Kaminari out. Because I have a Charizard, which is a perfect counter to a Venusaur. There aren't many points in the game you need to fly. Uh, it really helps in the late game. Just speed some processes along. Hmm. I guess what it could do is just um, use it on Hang a mod that can't see. Days. That's mercy. Good job. My brain remembered. Um, I feel like what I would do is just put it on a mod that can't normally learn it and just not use it in battle. And you're sending a Nido Queen. Hmm. Mm. Now we get Kamenari right back out here and shift to Anchor Arms. Rock smash! Who's ready for new challenges? Uh, it's about time for that, isn't it? Sure is. Alright, let me do that swap. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. You know what I love about these later episodes? What's up? I don't have to timestamp changes in the layout as often. Because what changes? Exactly. Because we don't have mons die. You hit me with? What damage? I wonder if I need like poison thing. Possibly or a scratch. Oh no. That sounds like a shiny thing. Yep. Spend your time shiny hunting in the route of your choice. If you find a shiny, you can continue. Hooray! Okay, so I'm stuck. Your challenge is... Let's see what we got. Lazy day. Oh no. She's gonna have to take a nap. Because honestly, naps sound great. Play with one hand and the other hand just rest on the armrest. Failure to do so, sack come on. Okay. So it's nothing really crazy for no. either one of us. All right, so oh, we need to get this your screen back. Yeah, my mouse is so sensitive; now. Okay. it throws me off a lot. Ooh. Yeah, it's fine. I'm not, I'm not really gonna miss out on much here, you know. Um, I mean, I'm getting some extra XP from my lads. Is that on the root of my choice? Yeah. So like, I could move on, but at the same time, it has no point because I'm just gonna. I'm I'm very unlikely to use whatever I catch. I mean, getting a shiny in Emerald would be dope. Yeah, I know. The, the odds are very stacked against me, especially in 15 minutes. But if you did it, you'd be like, wow. It'd be kind of legendary. I mean, I would admire you. Be like, wow. But, like, we don't have the shiny charm or anything, so it's like... No, it's dumb luck. Especially in this. Like, it's one of, like, 8,000 odds. And Emerald is soup. It has some extra weirdness to it, too. Oh, yeah. I don't know what it is offhand, but I've heard people bemoaning shiny hunting in Emerald. What the heck does bemoaning mean? Complaining about, like, oh, why is this so hard? Oh. Does it? Does that just mean the same thing as moaning, then? Or is bemoaning kind of, different? I think it's slightly different, but I re don't quite remember how it reads. Where did you learn this word bemoaning? Older texts. I... Just bringing up more questions. What older text are you reading? I mean, let's see. I read something from a French guy, the King Arthur story. Once are, in Future King. Are you just finding this like on the internet or like? No, I just kind of. And I remember I read a lot of books when I was younger. Sure. So I might have found it in one of those. Or was it maybe in the Redwall series, which I really should start rereading, because Redwall was great. Ooh, I could drop Quick Attack for Swift. I haven't even finished the Aragon series, trying to start another one. No, that's for act, like physical reading. Because no one does audiobooks of Redwall, or at least it's not come. Wait, I could have forgot Lear. Yeah. I was a little curious why you didn't too, but that's just me. I mean, I didn't think it through. 
But on a cheerier note, I get a no miss move. So now if anything starts evasion shenanigans, I'm just like, no, whack. I want you to know this episode has been like best case scenario for you. It is. I'm trying to get my way back up there so I can just run in the gym and pray. Yeah, this is straight up been 30 minutes of me just sitting around. Hey, I can smite that with my fist. Yeah. Fist of fate. Why don't you just use the lantern? It has, doesn't have an electric type move. It has a water type move at the very least. Mask rain. It's not water bug. It's bug flying. Uh huh. Yeah. I mean, why don't you have it lead? You know. Oh. <laughs> That's fair. Huh. I'm gonna leave Kaminari out for the zap ghost. Sure, sure. Because I resist it. Whereas it would be neutral on a lantern. Oh, you're a jerk. Yeah, but you resist that real well. Good job. Peck. Ow. Would you say your favorite type of food is Italian? Yeah, I basically say that. I do like other things as well. Like, Caribbean jerk is delicious. Mm -hmm. Do you like all Caribbean food or is that very certain one? That one is particular because a lot of Caribbean stuff I can't eat due to my allergies. Which doesn't make it easy. Just because, you know, it's difficult for me to find food I can eat. What do I have? I have this heal powder. How well are you maintaining that one arm thing? It's right here. Yeah, doing pretty well with it? Yeah, I'm, I can adapt to this. My hand, unless my hand cramps. Like, obviously, we can't show it very easily on camera. Because, like, then you gotta do a whole thing messing around with the camera. And I'm just, I don't want to. All right. I remember there's a trainer over here. Why? I think they fell off their bike. I feel like there have to be a hidden item over there for there to be a trainer. They're a psychic, too. Uh, there's a mega stone in uh, later. That makes you feel better. I don't think I've ever gotten that mega stone thing, because I do not. Next day? Doesn't Watson give you that? No. Are you sure? Wait, my lightning rod can't doesn't do... Wow, you crit me. You don't- you have lightning rod? Yeah, my lantern is lightning rod, but it didn't do anything. I may look fighting hip now. Um... Flail! Because I lost a fair bit of health. Yeah, good job. I was really expecting that to do more. I don't understand flail. Let's see if water gun does more. I don't know how the percentages work for how much health you have to the power that it does. I think it's also dependent on what your actual numbers for your HP are. <sighs> do mostly, yeah, because that did a lot more. Do mostly mods with good HP uh, learn flail? Fair portion. Thankfully, Blissey doesn't. Does it not? Thank God, no. Does it learn Covet? Covet's an item stealing move. Mm. Fun move. You know, I kind of feel like this challenge should come with speed up. Wow, you don't even one-shot this thing? And you're gonna get poisoned? Oh, he didn't. Wow. Oh, my God, I was waiting on it. I was like, poison, poison. I got poison in my pants. I miss Doofenshmirtz. Did, did that relate to what I said? I made me think of Phineas and Ferb's song with squirrels in my pants. Oh, okay. And I was like, I kind of miss Doofenshmirtz. I mean, they're still making stuff for Phineas and Ferb. I mean, he, he actually apparently showed up in another show. Yeah. Uh, what, uh, hold on, what show was it? I don't remember what it was, but it was by the same creators. Well, I was I was wondering if it was like Milo Murphy's Law. Might have been. Because like, I think those shows happen in the same universe. Which is weird, but I... I, I think they do, you know. <laughs> I've never actually watched that show, so... I mean, neither have I. I've got other things to work on. Too many shows, not enough time in my life. <laughs> this literally just reminds me of the conversation we were having about, like, productivity versus, you know, like, your mm -hmm. personal enjoyment. Yeah, yeah. But that was a... It's a heavy conversation, but I completely get where you're coming from. It's like, I don't have time to watch stuff about uh, Phineas and Ferb, but I definitely have time to uh, watch all these other shows and read. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's like... Really? Are you sure? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know. <laughs> I mean, I don't not acknowledge it where I'm like, 
Yeah, I could be doing something else. Bro, I still have to shine out for another seven minutes. <laughs> Me. Or I get a shiny and then I move on. <laughs> Let me dream. You do that, I'll give you money for my wallet. Oh, great. Because at that point, you deserved it. Do I get to choose how much? No. Oh. <laughs> Darn it. Because there's only a dollar in my wallet. Well, technically, there's a card in there that has access to more money. <laughs> no, no. Uh, I need that because I still have a week out to pay. Same. And you know, I like food. That's why you gotta make food at home and then bring it to work in your lunchbox. That's what I've been doing. It saves me a lot. I should. But I also want to get the hell out of there for like that hour because it's really nice. I mean, yeah, but you still can bring your food in a lunchbox to like park. Because like I doubt you're going inside to eat the food, are you? Nah, I just chill. Yeah, exactly. So it's the uh, same thing. Rock grass. What is your weakness? Ice? Rock grass. Yeah, I think it's only weak to ice. And fighting. I feel like grass resisted fighting. No. Poison resists fighting. I mean, it is hard to... Oh, right. I forgot you had that. Yeah, and you also don't learn a grass type move. No. I'm just gonna throw it under the wall. Uh, I also think steel is super effective on it, too. Yeah. Lily just happens to have that really awkward typing to work around. And ice. Though Lily gets terrible moves. Yeah, the best move it actually gets for itself is ancient power. For rock, it gets to pick up key drain. No, it doesn't. At least it learns it through TM. Definitely learns it through TM. Which is ideally your option. I think it, the only actually grass move it gets is ingrain. You think I picked up another one? I mean, I'm just shiny hunting. Why don't I look? That's fair. While well, I fight the wind straights, because I'm, I'm here. Do you remember um, what your challenge is? Yes. What is it? One oh, arm. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, why are you playing one arm too? That's so, so weird. <laughs> <laughs> you I'm actually kind of scared of, so flail. I didn't do that much. I knew that was coming. No, we're we you're out. We out of here. We're gonna bring in our anchor arms. Let's see, Gen yeah. three. The only move Lily gets is ingrain for grass. And let's confirm with Cradily. I'm glad she said his name because actually it was like, oh, what's its name? I... Is ingrain. I'm kind of sad for it. Yup. I like, also think um, Ancient Power is its only rock type. Yep. I just feel bad now. Yeah, Gen, gen 3 is really bad. I mean, it didn't get good till like Gen 5, Gen 6, and even Our still. Armaldo is better. No, it's not. A little. I don't. I think the only bug type move he gets is Fury Cutter. Yeah, because he can't learn Mega Horn, which is the best bug type move in this generation. And X Scissor doesn't exist yet. Tragically. My team is looking... Let me... And nope, it doesn't get Silver Wind. And as for Rock-type moves, I think it's also best with Ancient Power. I know there's a move tutor for Rock Slide. Yeah, I'm not 100% if he can learn it. I think so. I I don't know. But just, like, their natural movesets are just so trash. All right, uh, Lantern Bales. Right now I feel bad. Why do these fossils get so screwed? I mean, it's all Pokemon, it's not just the fossils. Or Aerodactyl. Just kidding, actually, Aerodactyl got awesome later. <laughs> Aerodactyl's pretty good now. It starts with a wing attack, for one. It started with wing attack from the get-go. Right, but, like, you give it fly, it's pretty good. Give it rock slide, it's carry. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure it actually can learn that. And then, even worse, you could give it Stone Edge. Not in this generation, but we digress. Let's see, let's go for Anorith, that's the name. Um, Fury Cutter is its only bug type move, but it picks up Ancient Power and Rock Blast. Ooh, Rock Blast. I bug mean, are you? Rock Blast is only 80 accuracy. I so. mean, that's the thing. For some reason, all Rock type moves are really low accuracy. 
The ancient power isn't. Okay, correction. Most rock type moves. Also, I just want to point out though that that thing also learns um, metal claw and water gun. I guess the the water gun is acceptable because it is originally a C Pokemon. Yeah, but they can't give it another bug type move. Let's look at all the bug type moves. Twin needle. Uh huh. No. Let's just stick with like attacking bug type moves. That is. I know. Um. Uh... No, that, sorry, that was for a second. I was like, that's a bug type move. No, it's not. That's poison sting. Leech life. Mm -hmm. Actually, I don't really see any reason why not on that one. Mm -hmm. But why would you give it? Because it's terrible in I this mean, game. At least you could have stab it towards the beginning. It doesn't learn Fury Cutter until it's 20s. Ouch. All right, then. Uh, Silver Wind. It doesn't have scales to use the move. Yep. Mega Horn. No. <sighs> I just, I just want to give it to it just because... Give it something. Yeah. I mean, I don't disagree. I, like, it needs something. Is there any other bug type move? Like, attacking bug type move? I'm running the math for a moment. There aren't very many. No, that move doesn't... They added more bug type moves in Gen 4. So it's like, no. Please don't. Oh, thank goodness. Sorry, Firo picks up Pursuit, and I'm like, oh, no. That'd be very funny. No, Lantern, I like you. But yeah, there's not really any... It can legitimately learn. Yeah, I feel like Megahorn its... is the best option. And, like, two Mon pick that up. Maybe a little more. But I know Stantler gets access due to its very nice antlers. I think Scizor is also a similar boat with it, where it's like, it doesn't get good Bug-type moves either. It just gets Fury Cutter. It doesn't really get good Steel-type move either. It gets Metal Claw. And that's it. At least Metal Claw is stronger than that. Metal Claw is base 50, which is fun. Yeah, and Fury Card is base 20. I it was base 10. I mean, does And it then really... it does the whole double power thing. Which yeah, is... so you gotta build it up. Like, if Metal Claw gets its attack boost, then it's still gonna be better. And we're gonna bail. Go Charizard. Use Leaf Blade. Well, as soon as you're done fighting Granny, we'll be done with this episode. So I'll just continue shiny hunting until then, I guess. I mean... Oh. Diglett was a jerk. Did you already have your Charizard out? No. Oh, okay. I I sent Lantern. I was gonna say, like, this Diglett's weird. This Diglett's an idiot! What are you doing, Diglett? Yeah. Alright, that finishes that. All right, and this is going to be the end of this episode, and I hope you guys have enjoyed, and remember to check back on Wednesday for the next one. All right, then. Bye for now.